Okay, so hello everyone. This is my presentation, and um, the project name my project is Nasco Residence in Hotel Management System. And I will start with the login form. So, this is my login form, and um, this is my login form, which is asking for the username and password. So if we write any wrong username and password so this will show us login error whereas if we write the correct username and password so this will show us um a message box showing login successfully and then proceed to the software so this is our software the project that i have created the first form is the hotel status which is showing us the total number of um, guests and the total number of rooms that are right now available in the uh, uh, in the hotel and um, this is just a to-do list thing which uh, which the manager or the user can change accordingly once he is done with the task and um, this is an overview form whereas there is a second form the add guest form where you can see the guest list um this is showing us you know the all the guests that are right now in the hotel and if we want to search any one so we can just type their customer id and we'll get to know the um, customer record if you want to add any guest we can just add from their list form for example um, adding this m15 is the customer ID and the adults are maybe two with one child something okay so if we add the new guests what will happen that this record will get here just wait a second yeah so this is the record i just added so moving on to the rooms form we have here are other records of the rooms that are um, available right now in the hotel and um, so here we have all the number of rooms and if you want to delete any we can just delete from here and this record will get deleted Okay, so um, this is if we want to update any record, for example, if we want to update any room rate, something you know, like 30 something, we can update it, and then this will update as well. And we can also add any new one, for example, 108 with the if we get this as double and number of beds are two maybe i will go triple okay so the room rate is um 35 and we will update it and then the record will come here right below we have one check-in form where we can just you know get write the check-in details of the customer this is basically showing us the current date and time um we can just change it a little bit the guests are three for three days i gave them the room number eight which is triple i guess the type and uh, it will come here with so if we check in 
So what will happen, this record will come in a checkout form, just as you can see here, for the M15 I just created. So this is the checkout, which basically what it does that if I want to, you know, check out any customer, I can just check out. And what will it do that it will delete that record of the customer from the system. And at the end, we just have one billing form where we, we can just um, get the billing details of the customer. I, we can write any, just write number of nights, maybe three with 30 room rate. So the main coding is here that maybe if the charges are 30 and the additional are something 10 with the text as 5 so it will basically calculate the actual room rate which would be like 45 monra so this is all about this like today's time and today's date and this is all of my forms that i have made in the application and um, yep here we can just log out so thank you very much and goodbye